Oh man, it's about to go down. What is going on everybody? How are y'all doing? We have some epic, epic, epic gaming news to go over today. Before we get started, give the video a huge, huge, huge thumbs up, like, like, like. If you're not subscribed, click subscribe. We have some big, big, big Nintendo Switch news for one epic video. All right, let's get started. The Nintendo Switch 2 rumors continue to heat up. I mean, they are on. Where's my fire? Fire. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's talk about the latest Nintendo Switch 2 rumor, specifically a launch date. And the answer is in the dunes. The dunes. All right. This is coming from Tom'sGuy.com. Bruh. The Switch 2 centered around this game right here. Developer Funcom has announced Dune Awakening. And... If you notice the platform listings, it says PC, PS5, Xbox S1, that's the Xbox series consoles, and then the last slot says to be announced for another console that this platform will be launching on. Two things. This could be the first announced Nintendo Switch 2 game and it gives us a window of when the Switch 2 could be launching. Now, this game was a well man, this game looks crazy good. The the game was originally announced in 2022 with no uh, launch uh, uh, confirmed date. It's speculating it's going to be sometime in 2023 will be when this game comes out. And guess what? The rumors are saying that the Switch is launching holiday 2023. So Dune Awakening, um, there's a platform that, uh, that says to be announced, meaning it's probably in development. And I'm sure behind the scenes, developers probably are starting to get, to get Switch 2 development kits. It's about to heat up. I think after Zelda, after they get Zelda and Pikmin out the way, after July, Nintendo's going to pivot and start talking about their holiday lineup. Bro, that Nintendo live event that's coming in September, that's going to be lit. That's going to be lit. Speaking of Zelda, OMG, that Zelda trailer yesterday was so good demise i pointed it out before anybody else bro you see the red dreadlocks that's demise from skyward sword the original ganon really ganon is a manifestation of demise that's why they showed ganon so early i mean so much in this trailer because they never reveal who the final boss is if you notice in skyward sword they showed girahim and we thought that he was the big villain, but lo and behold, it was Ganon. I think in, in Tears of the Kingdom, they showed us Ganon, they showed his face, just to let us know that we're going to be battling Demise again, bro. The battle, the final ba boss battle with Demise and Skyward Sword, best final boss battle in any Zelda game. Ocarina Time gets a close second with the huge Ganondorf and you're escaping the castle afterwards, but Demise was crazy lit, bro. All right. Speaking of Tears of the Kingdom, a Zelda Tears of the Kingdom commercial has apparently leaked, has apparently leaked. And of course, 
uh, I'm not going to, um, I can't post anything, but this is coming from Reddit. Um, someone on Reddit posted what looks like to be an unfinished video of a TV commercial for Tears of the Kingdom. Really, at this point, I don't want to say anything else. After that, oh my goodness, after that epic trailer, I don't want to see anything else. I just want to play the game. So, we're lit, we're lit, we're lit. Still on Zelda. There's a Splatoon Zelda crossover. That's right. Splatoon 3 has announced their next Splatfest. And it's going to be Zelda themed. The Triforce. Tricolor Wars Triforce. It was bound to happen. So, which team? The teams are Power, Wisdom, or Courage. We already know the most popular team is going to be Courage. But we're going Power, boy. We're going Power, boy. We're going Team Power. <laughs> All right, <coughs> so should be lit, should be lit, should be lit, should be lit. All right, y'all thought we was done? We hitting y'all with another one. Let's get to the next news item, bro. The Super Mario Brother movie. By the way, I'm gonna go see another. My, I'm gonna go see it again today. But the Super Mario movie has just passed. 500 million worldwide in revenue and is now the biggest video game movie of all time. Sony and Microsoft could never. <laughs> but that's crazy. That is great news for Nintendo. Super Mario Brothers movie, the biggest video game movie of all time time breaking all kinds of records this lets me there's definitely going to be a super mario brothers 2 there's definitely going to be more uh mario movies coming uh, more nintendo movies in general we could get a zelda the sky's the limit now we could get a zelda netflix series nintendo is finally starting to realize the power of their ips and we are here for it but bro the next news item is so Epic, my childhood. Contra on the NES, blowing the cartridges. Bro, Contra is so lit on the NES. And guess what? It looks like there's been rumors that Konami is coming back into action in the video game sphere. And the latest rumor is, way forward, it looks like they're working on a new Contra game from Konami bro this is perfect 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 a all new Contra game I'm here for it and I'm hoping it's a 2D game not pixel I'm hoping it like it's updated with like good graphics and stuff but 2D T keep it 2D to the roots and they gotta keep the Contra code in there bro they gotta have the up up down down left right left right BA select start bro for two players bro so all new Contra game, I'm here for it. So much dope news. It's a great time to be a gamer, ladies and gentlemen. Zelda. All right, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I wanna know, but before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All thanks, Nintendo. We out, boy. This channel that I'm about to throw out there for you guys reminds me of me back when I had like 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, man. And um, he's probably gonna lose shit when I do this, but hey, man, I gotta say, my boy OB1, my boy OB1, man, that nigga is my nigga right there. He reminds me exactly of me when I was doing this shit on a smaller level. His channel, when I look at it, it's such a nostalgia trip. And he has a really cool audience too, man. And if you could show this nigga some love too, that'd be awesome. I don't shout people out unless I like them a lot. A lot. I'm picky with that. But, um. Anyways, my boy Obi Wan. Your boy Obi Wan. Hey man, I got you right here, my boy. Get that man a little bit of a look, man. He reminds me of me when I was smaller. You want to take a look in the past, my boy? This is the way you do it. I got you, Jedi homie. Master the right Jedi Obi -Wan. Master. <laughs> I got you, man. You're playing two towns. I got you, homie. I'm dedicating a workout set. To you, my boy. Let's go, man. <laughs> 27, 28! He's hitting on the end! <laughs>